Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to do a product review of something I have been wanting to do for a while. You might be wondering why am I wearing this hat? Because it's freaking cold out. It is March and it is ice cold out and I am snowed in and so I was like, you know what? What a great time to film some videos. So um, the product review I wanted to do was on Molly Cosmetics Scylla Sponge. Now, I don't know if you guys have seen this. I know, like, Jeffrey started a review on it, and he said it was called, he called it the beauty killer, or beauty, he called it the beauty blender killer. Now, pretty much, um, I ordered this product in, back in December, maybe January, December? December. And it did not get to me until mid-January. So I haven't had it too long, but um, it came in, a, it came in a, a little bit of a bigger package, but this is what the actual sponge came in. It's got their cute logo. I actually like their logo. Um, it's Molly Cosmetics. I believe they are based out of Hong Kong. Hong Kong? Hong Kong. I'm not sure. Um, so that's why it probably took so long. It has to go through customs to get to you, uh, yada, yada, yada. Uh, but it does take about a month, and they were on back order at the time. Uh, this product, it looks like this. And it retails for, I believe, $10 right now. Now that doesn't include the shipping. They have another sponge that's like similar. The texture is the same, but it is round and it's got like a little bit of like glitter or sparkles in it. But um, this is the Scylla sponge. The cool thing about this is it is made of silicone. That is why the name is Scylla sponge. When I used this product, I wasn't, um, I had no expectation going into it whatsoever. Um, when I use, pro mainly what I use to put my foundation on is uh, like a kabuki brush or like a, a stippling brush or whatnot and just kind of, you know, buff it in. Occasionally I'll use a sponge. So I, I'm, I'm not really a sponge person. I don't like it because it gets bacteria in it and, um, you know, you can wash your sponge, I guess, if you really want to. I just throw mine away and buy new ones. But, um, the cool thing about this is you can wash it every time. So, and... I don't know how long these will typically last if you use it every day. I've probably used this product maybe eight times. Um, I really, really do like it. I'm not used to blending with it, so it does take me a little bit longer than, than say, my, my brush or what I'm used to. Now, the cool thing about this product, I'm going to show you um, on my hand like how well it blends in, is that it takes a very little product. You can literally take a dot of your foundation like put it all over the skin and it literally just blends in. Okay. Doesn't want to stop ringing. So the thing that I can't get used to about this is the fact that you don't have to use so much foundation. I'm used to just, you know, the amount of foundation I put on is the amount I'm used to. And when I'm using this one, it's like you literally take a dot. Um, and I already have my makeup on, so I, I didn't want to take it off, but I, I'm going to show you on my hand. I'm literally going to put a dot like that. Okay, you see that? And this is just, this, this is the Smashbox Studio Skin 15 Hour Hydrating Foundation. So I'm putting a dot like this on my hand. Now I'm going to sit here I swear to goodness, my neighbor, my neighbor's been like making noises all, like all afternoon and it's kind of freaking me out. I'm not going to lie to you. Anyway, so you literally just blend it in like such and it just like, it lays on the skin so nice. Um, I don't know if. I don't even know if I'm using it right. I don't know, you know, I definitely, it's got like a little bit of a seam right here on the end. I mean, I wouldn't, I guess you could kind of get in the crease like that. I don't really know, like in your nose or in your nose area. Uh, but I will tell you this product, um, I like it. It's so interesting. I think it is a game changer for, for blending. I think there are always going to be sponges. There's always going to be brushes, but if you're looking for something to kind of like add to your beauty routine, you definitely do use less product, which I like, and you definitely can clean it. So like if, if, if acne is a problem or if you have a problem with, you know, skin breakouts, pimples, maybe this is a good thing because you're not, you're not using something that harbors bacteria in it. So I would say with this product, I definitely give it two thumbs up. Um, I would recommend it to anybody and it's only like 10 bucks. I think with shipping, it might be 15. 
So I would say definitely um, go to mollycosmetics.com and put in your order and get one. And if you guys have it, let me know what you think. If you like it, if you don't, um, leave a comment in the comment section below. And until next time, I will talk to you guys later. Bye!